You know, all the puzzles and stuff in this area, this whole cyber world, all of this is reminding me a lot of Metaton. Like, if Metaton were to show up in this cyber world, it would fit so perfectly. I don't know if he actually will, but it would fit. Anyways, what's up, Ant City, and welcome back to another episode of Deltarune. In the last one, we got kidnapped by the Queen and brought to... Uh, she made, like, these individual little rooms for us that were... They were like specialized jail cells, I guess. And we ended up breaking out. We learned a lot about Birdly. Shout out to my man's Birdly. Like, he's, he's a real one. Let's see if he gets more, even more development coming up. But, yeah, we found out more about Birdly. And that's basically where we ended the episode off last time. So now, we're just going to go ahead and continue onward. Let's see. There's a dinner table in here. Ooh, this looks fancy. This downstairs table will be for our special, for our special guests. There's a dinner party on the second floor for everyone else. Everything here is tailored for you, right? I think so, yeah. Where did Birdly go? That, that's screaming. Rossi? They think... That, if, if that's Rossi, I wonder why he's screaming. Um, you don't have to scream. It's not even him, it's them. Just because you like my outfit. It's them, my gosh. Oh, Chris, Susie, um... How may I serve you? The hell are you doing? Um, Queen didn't have a room for me, so, uh... She made me into one of her butlers instead. She has a butler outfit on my god. Whatever, Rossi, can you hear will answer? Oh. <laughs> it's cold. Susie. Or Susie. I'm afraid this is something I can't heal. W what? Lancer is... Whoa! Lancer! Lancer, hey! You see, each dark fountain creates a different world. A world whose darkness reflect the, reflect the will of its fountain. But those those darkness can exist in their own world. They might not belong if they go to another one. Okay, see? Again, back on Rossi being... So Why is Rossi okay, then? He's been perfectly fine. He's about to explain it? Maybe. So can we help him? Yes, there is a way. Castletown's Grand Fountain is made of pure darkness. As long as it stays flowing, any darkner can live there. So, if we bring Lancer back to school, he'll be okay again. So we just need to get out of here, huh? Right. Alright. Lancer, we'll be back for you, buddy. Your friend, if we defeat Queen, we can save him? Uh, yeah. With me out of the way, Queen, it's going to force Noelle to do her bidding. And if Noelle doesn't want to, she might make her face into a robot one. Susie, did you assist me in saving Noelle? Huh? Me? I just can't do it by myself. But if you can help me, I have a plan. A plan? I remember from Queen's tour of this place. There's a secret shortcut on the third floor. While Chris is distracting Queen, Susie will take the shortcut to reach Noelle and transfer her to me on the roof. From there, I'll bring her to a safe hiding spot. And together, we can all defeat the Queen. Alright, sure, we'll give it a shot. Haha, <laughs> most excellent. Then, see you on the roof, fellow agent. Gosh. All right, let's go. So, okay, see? Raw. <laughs> Would you take that off already? Sorry. Oh my gosh, little pose. Okay, see? So you know how Rossi explained how if a darkness doesn't belong in a certain world, then this, what happened to Lancer might happen? Like I said, I don't want to suspect Rossi, but why is he perfectly okay traveling between worlds like that? And like, he was able to make it 
all the way to this realm from his realm. So that means he must have gone to the real world. And he knows about the classroom and all that. So he must have come to the real... He must actually be a Lightener then. That's the only thing that, I, that makes sense to me. Because... Think about it. I, me and Susie, we're able to freely travel between the dark realm... The, you know, Rossi's home our home and this cyber world we're able to do that no effects on us we just change our costumes but rossi can also travel freely is what it's looking like because he was able to go from his his home to this cyber world and i think the only way he could have done that is traveling through the real world and going through the computer lab which remember nobody was in the library so we could have just snuck there without getting caught so i think rossi might actually be a, a lightener i don't know how though or maybe he's got some special thing about him that makes it ape makes him able to travel freely between the worlds. I don't know. But like I said, something's up with Ralsei. I'm I'm suspicious. But yeah, we'll come back for you, buddy. Oh, we could push him. Well, let's just push him all the way with us then. I don't want to just leave him here. Let's see if I can push him all the way. Can I push him up the stairs or no? Or I get stuck. What if I push him all the way the other way? I might just speed this up for you. <laughs> what? Now he seems to be well taken care of. What? Now he's a chef? He's serving food? And it made the splat noise again. Okay, I can't push him anymore. <laughs> okay, this was worth pushing him to the table. What splatted on there? Ketchup and mustard? Rossi, good luck. Although you only joined us for minutes, we'll miss you. Oh, I get it. Red and yellow, because these guys are red and yellow. Like ketchup and mustard. Combined, we have enough seats for everyone in the world. Alright, well, let's get going then. Lancer seems to be vibing right now, so I guess we'll just leave him here. We'll come back for him, though, like we said. So let's go. But yeah, Rossi's up to something. Well, let's save right here. Looking at these legs <laughs> fills you with a certain po a certain power. Oh, Chris, a thigh man? Anyway. Um, there's a cafe here. There's a sands door. Okay. I feel like I should I should use this because there were a few areas that I needed to explore still, weren't there? So there's the trash zone. Let's go to the trash zone. Because isn't that guy... Didn't that guy tell us to meet him down here? Oh, yeah, I remember. Down here to the left, there's a door. I want to go back over there. Because, yeah, I think that castle might be the final area. Let's go through here. Oh, it's unlocked. Let's go in. What? You want to go in by yourself? Whatever. Do what you want. Hey, every... It's me, Spamton G. Spamton. Bye, buy more talking. Let's make a deal. Our deal. Chris, you little sponge. I knew you'd come here on a Saturday night. After all, you want to be in a big shot. Uh, oh, you want to be a big shot. Uh, wow, how can you be? Listen, in the deep abyss of Queen's Mansion, a great deal is waiting for a limited time only. A heaven-piercing workout-ready bot. Designed by the classic you've come to expect. C 1997. First, that little nipper is our one-way ticket to make you big. Make me big. Before you know it, we will be taking a ride around town on our special connut. Kung Kungadero. Vacationing and burning acid while you soak in the hyperlink block. But Chris, don't breathe yet. The way is locked by a high quality encryption. You'll never get inside. Wait, Chris, look, hear those two balloons? You are one hundred you are a thousandth customer. As a commemorative ring, I will let you buy key gen from from me at the low low price of What do you think? It's such a steal. I'm i I'm what himself? Take this deal and you will die. Is that good? Buy the keygen for me, unlock the basement, and get the empty disc. Make a deal. Let's talk about him. I used to be nothing but the email guy. Now I'm the it burns out stop help me it burns guy. Whoa. Amazed that this amazing transformation you two can't have a communication with unintelligible. I wonder if we can fix him. Because he's definitely glitching out. Soon I'll even surpass that damn clown around town. But unlike him, I'm gonna beat shoot for this guy and get on the path to the big one. I'll, I'll get so, 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 I'll get so. Hyperlink block. Okay, let's talk about the night. Speaking of communion, Chris, did you know that the night? No, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to. Too many excess vacation days. Take a goddamn vacation straight to hell. Oh, friends. 
me, friend. Uh, Chris, you and me are already friend request, except we don't need anyone else. We don't need anyone easels or CRTs. We don't need any man, woman, or child at half price. We don't need Mike. Mike. Chris, don't believe anything you see on TV. The man's a criminal. I tell you, a criminal. Why is his friend still yellow? Okay, yeah, we already saw this. I don't know, something's up with this guy. Oh, let's keep talking to him. Let's talk about fear. What are you afraid of? According to Encyclopedia of Being Afraid, there's nothing to fear except... Can anyone hear me? Help. Whoa! Uh, what? No, no, I didn't hear anything just now. Some, I feel I feel bad for this dude, because he's just all messed up and glitched out. I want to help him. But it sounded like they were talking to you. Interesting. Okay, let's buy. Like, run away. So, how much is this? Oh, I see. We can stop it at whatever we want. Okay. We gotta stop it at 34. Nine. Perfect. Delicious Cromer. So that gives me more attack. Whoa. I don't does that actually give me plus 48? I don't know. We're gonna try to buy it. Let's get for, let's wait for a good price. 54 was the lowest I've seen so far. 54. Let's do that. We might buy three of these, because I feel like what I'm about what I'm doing here might be what leads to the secret boss. Because remember, um, Sham was telling us that there's one in each realm. Like, we might... He was telling us we might find more of those shards. I'm assuming that's another secret boss. If it's anything like Jevil, we're going to be here for a minute. Oh, man. I don't know if I'm ready for another Jevil. But let's try to get this for 51 Chromer. Let's see. Also, I just noticed this song has Gaster's theme in it, too. 52. Perfect. Okay. I bought three of them, I think. We can get big one, but... Let's buy one potion, too. Okay. Buy more sell, right? No, buy more is literally just buying again. Run away. Hurry up and buy. Alright, let's get out of here. Mansion, basement, find it. So we gotta get to the basement. What kind of creepy stuff were you buying anyway? Nah. We gotta even wanna know. Yikes. She said she hoped if it was candy, you'd share with her. Shut up, Chris. <laughs> <laughs> my gosh alright let's see what that stuff I bought was the frayed it's, it doesn't even give me that much better armor Okay, it's definitely not better than Jevil's tail well what about for the other two I bought them because it says it would give everyone better defense but it literally doesn't I don't think it affects my defense at all I don't know it does it brings my defense down by one and my attack well what about for everyone else oh they can't even wear <laughs> An old bow tie lost much of his defensive value. So it looks like. Oh, he can wear it. Oh, this. Oh, more attack and magic, not defense. Yeah, we want it for defense, not for attack. Uh, what about that wood blade? Oh, that was my old weapon. Okay. So we bought that. I think it was a key item, right? Yeah, we bought this key gen. Key, we bought a key gen. Um. So, we gotta find the mansion basement. Okay, let's try to go look for that. Okay, let's keep going. So, we're gonna go back to the castle now. So, yep, through the door. So, yeah, to the mansion. I think that was the only place I needed to go back to. Unless there's somewhere else I'm forgetting. But, so, we gotta find the basement floor of this place. It's a cybernetic bookshelf. There's a book here about shortcuts that open up later. Interesting. It's a cybernetic bookshelf. There's a book here about... Yeah, same thing. So we can go into the cafe. Welcome to Color Cafe. Let us warm your day. There's butler juice. Butt juice, my god. A handsome bow tie. Ooh, the, the, oh, I was going to buy these, but they're expensive? Golly, that's expensive. You know what, though? I'm probably going to sell... I'm going to sell some of these bow ties. Oh, they're not, they're not even worth selling. <laughs> they sell for, like, nothing. Okay, we're going to keep them then. What oh, pocket items? Yeah, nothing that worth selling here either. Uh, I might buy one of these pins for like Rossi or something because his defense is usually low. I'll buy one and see who I need to give it to, but I'm not buying three. Like, like I said, I just want to be prepared <laughs> for um, 
whatever this secret boss is. I'm assuming it's going to be secret boss, but after my experience with, uh, you know, with, 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 with Jevil, I, I don't know if I'm ready for another secret boss. Well, let's see, let's talk to him. Ah, forgive me for not introducing myself sooner, young masters. I am Swatch, or Lady Grace's head butler. <clears throat> when we are not attending to her needs, I and the Queen's other staff use this room as our humble yet colorful gift shop slash cafe. Please, shop to your heart's content. We are eager to serve your any wish. Mission statement. Does a woman of Our Lady's Grace's caliber not deserve a coven of powerful men and women to dote upon her every movement? To have rap anthems written to her kindness. Rap anthems? Which are then bit crushed by yon recognition to make them more computer? To have melons smashed with karate chops repeatedly for no apparent reason. To have barrels thrown from the rafters. And make us smash them all with karate chops before the timer runs out. But the barrels are full of melons and we have to smash those too. Yes, the answer is yes. Wow, rule, rule card. Yeah, where's he at? Rule. I'm afraid I'm not familiar with the guess of that moniker. Yeah, because he fell out of my pocket. Where has he been at? Ah, wait. Are you perhaps referring to that unbearable... Uh, unique man who barged in here and demanded to be me demanded to be mean butler supremus? I'm afraid that person is now banned from this establishment. And may have suffered injuries as a result of his, uh, rather swift ejection. Please do not mention him again. <sighs> the PTSD is too much. We are still cleaning up the worms he left on the floor. Outfit. Ah, oh, my outfit, yes. The monochrome look is quite suitable, isn't it? Black suit, colored glasses, many people have failed to imitate this look. Some even go as far as to as so bleh. some people even going so far as to attempt to impersonate me in order to get the oh never mind macaron. <laughs> My gosh! All right, well let's get out of here. I'll be waiting for you with rose rose tinted glasses. All right, so we got to figure out where this basement is. So I'm gonna be thoroughly exploring here, just looking at these legs. <laughs> Fills me with certain power. I don't know. Chris kind of Chris likes legs, you know. Ooh, this music. I see you have oh, I see you have escaped from your room your room units. Who can blame you for wanting to see my glorious mansion? You won't want to take your eyes off this beautiful art. We're not here to look in stupid pictures. Oh, it was not a recommendation. I was just warning you, LMAO. The queen is literally just like a fan like a an elegant meme lord. That's what the queen is. It's such a She's written, written so well. Oh yeah, let's see. So let's replace this white ribbon with the royal pin. Yeah. These bow ties give me more that. Yeah, let, let's put the pin on. No, wait. Actually, I should give it to Rossi, huh? Yeah, let's do that. So let's put the white ribbon back on. Let's give that to Rossi because his defense is usually terrible. And that brings his magic up by one, too. So yeah. I think that's the best course of action here. Let me make sure there's nothing better for her. Nope. And for him. Oh, there's stuff better. Nothing better for defense is like I need. This dice race is exactly the same. Okay. So, alright, let's keep going. That one's <laughs> that one's red and has a mustache. Oh, and it constantly blasting fire. And I like I like how she has Mona Lisa pictures. Oh my gosh. So we gotta find a way past that. Constantly blowing. What is this? Okay, what did that, did that turn off those red ones, maybe? Let's go back up and check. Okay, let's run. Let's go check this. Oh yeah, it turned it off, okay. Is this the end? Now I know you, now I know you're all loving my mansion. But we have a few rules around here you have to follow. One, wipe your shoes. Two, have fun. Three, respect the pottery. Four, have fun. Five, list entry duplication error. Hold on, let, we'll come back to that in a second. I want to, because there was another one down here. I want to look at that. And then we can also go left over here. So I want to explore around a bit. Whoa, this one shoots in short bursts. Go, go, okay. Oh, a chest. We found revivement. Cool, we have some more revivements now that we can use. I like how they look like, they look kind of like Dr. Eggman in these pictures. Oh, oh, we already went over there. Okay. Now we just got to keep going. I swear, if this chapter has some insane secret boss, it, or if every chapter has one, I'm gonna, this game's gonna kill me. Okay. Oh. I didn't respect the part. I was just trying to interact with it. 
Swatchlings bowed in. Oh, I like how the music keeps playing. Uh, Coldify, Warmify. Oh, I see. So, Redder. And then we half warm you. We half cold you. Oh! I see. So, we have to do the opposite. Okay. So, the blue one's cold. The red one's hot. We gotta... Yeah, okay. What is, is he flying at us himself? What? <laughs> what is happening? Okay, so now I get what we have to do. We have to do the opposite. So we have to cultify you. Half warm. No, 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 wait, go back. Half warm this one. And then you got to half cold that one. You talked about the snows matted on the snow matted on your brother's snows. Turned a lot colder. <laughs> it's not yellow. Oh, it's now yellow. Hot peppers. Now he's green. Mint tea. Oh, so when they're green, they're, we can mercy them. We feel so coordinated. Thank you, Milk Masters. Oh, I thought green was going to be like an undertale when it's green. You can eat it. But nope. Why did I take that much damage from that? Come on, man. Let's spare these guys. <laughs> the, the way they just bow away. I didn't mean to disrespect the pottery. Let's not make that mistake again. Let's respect the pottery. Is it, why is there a finish line? Oh. Oh no! Oh. Well, let's smash them all then. Screw it. Destroy all the pottery. Yep, they're after me. I didn't think I had to balance that. Oh, that one changed. Oh, I thought he changed. Like I thought. Oh, he does. No, he doesn't. Okay. So let's warm you up, and then I guess just like block and. Oh no, we should heal up Rossi real quick. Yeah, give him some candy. And then Rossi, you need to cold one of these guys. Alright, cool. Ooh. Whoa! Bob and weave, maneuver. Okay, cool. So now let's get this one cold. I think we should... Do we have to turn them all this... It doesn't matter what color we turn them all. Can we just turn them all the same color? I think that's all we gotta do. Let's half cold you again. Now he's yellow. Oh yeah, we just gotta get them all to be the same color. Okay. Now he's yellow. Cool. So it doesn't matter. Oh wait, I just realized we can just travel underneath these. Yeah, that's a lot easier. Oh, there was candy in there! Dang. <laughs> they just want to have matching outfits. <laughs> now let's spare them. I think that this will be enough to recruit them too. Yeah, it is. Let's go. Just bow out. Right, what if I destroy all the pots? Yeah, okay. See, I tried to drop the pot here because I thought that would just fall down and maybe they wouldn't hear it, but ah, it still broke right there. Yeah, I just want to explore around thoroughly because we, we got to find that basement. Another finish line. I bet, I bet this finish line was if you actually managed to balance the pot and you got to there. And something would have happened. We gotta click these in order. So one. Penny is labeled task. So task. You gotta remember task. Timberly. Task. Task. Okay, so there's normal task. Then there's Timberly. Then there's task. K, task with a Q. And then task with a C. Task with a C. Okay. I should be able to remember that. So it's normal task, then Timberly, task Q, task C. Okay, got it. Guess we gotta go this way. Just in time for your appointment. Would you assist in organizing these paintings? Uh, sure. How refined. Then, the first question. Which painting's name is first alphabetically? Uh, so this one's task. There's Timberly. Um... Oh, it should be left. Oh, wait. It should be this one, because he was tasked with the C, right? How refined. Then the next question. Which painting's name is third, alphabetically? Okay, so there's task, task... I think... I mean, the last one should be Timberly, right? Oh. Oh, no. Okay, so we got it wrong. Task manager. Okay. Get it? Like, computer. Order X. <laughs> 
Everyone asks Taskmaster to show you order. She obliges. Chaos, chaos, no order, order. Now get rid of that silly tail. Oh, C. Ooh. B. E. Oh, that see, she she mentioned like the chaos chaos thing because I have Jevil's tail on me. Order again. Meow meow meow. C. A. B. A. All right. Order, order. I mean, order, order. C. D. C. I almost want B. E. Alright, this should be the last time we need to do this. E. C. Oh, I couldn't move quick enough. A. B. E. Alright. Now we can spare the task manager. We just gotta do an action on the tasks. See so how that task to get off for long. And we sp oh, we spared all of them. Okay, cool. Oh, I wish I could have got that right. So I guess the last one was the Q. Yeah, got him wrong. Oh well. I wonder what would have happened if I got him right though. Oh well. Let's get out of here. So what's so there's a way across the street. We can keep stopping them. But then hold on, what's up those stairs then? What's here? Second floor. Teacups. Oh, those do damage. Okay. I wish I knew that sooner. Gotta stay within the shadows. Okay. <laughs> wow, I, I really got hit by all of those. Can I get healed right now? No, I can't. I gotta use items to heal. Hopefully there's like a save point or something up here, though. Before we need to use an item. Oh, look, this guy's here. He's got hair. Psh, I'm the hacker. Nobody figured out it's out yet, but it's me. There's an... East treasure. There's an East treasure hallway leading to basement on on the first floor. Okay, come down there and I'll help you crack the code. So we gotta go back down to the first floor. Got it. There's just a mouse in there. There's a check mark in here. And then there's hair. <laughs> I am mouse mouse million. I I'm leagues and inches above all the other mice. Only Newbert remains above me still. Newbert moving up in the world. Um. Hey, I'm good at these. I think it's right here. Yep, got him. <laughs> Just blows up. So we gotta find our way back down to the first floor somehow. Whoa. Okay, let's heal now before I die. Or one of us gets clapped. Well, actually, I guess we were. Let's heal up Chris just a bit. Let's use that. Ooh, that was good. Okay. We just need Chris to not die. Oh, that leads to the first floor. What does this do? Oh, that opens up a, a, a hallway here. Okay, well, I want to go back down to the first floor, though, like this is saying. Shortcut to first floor. Okay. Oh. One of these. There's the key. Right here. <laughs> oh, yeah, I'm pretty good at those. So yeah, there we go, let's go down. Okay, now we can actually heal again. So we said east of the... So we have to go somewhere here. We need to, we need to find the hacker, dude. So we said east, so this way? Oof. So let's just keep heading east. What? Susie. Who's he? She didn't do this the first time, my gosh. Oh my god, Susie. Susie, no. Susie. Right, I'm just gonna let her do all of them. Why not? Let her destroy all of these. Gosh. Susie. I guess we can... You can do it faster than Susie. We destroyed every last pot. <laughs> so, somewhere on this floor, we gotta find... 
What did the hacker do? Maybe we should go back to the hacker, dude. I forgot what he said. But now we have a way back down to the first floor, at least. Oh, maybe he meant here. Maybe. Oh, yeah, because we never did this thing. Maybe this is how we get to the basement. Yeah, let's do this to get there. We never actually did this. Ooh. I barely made that one. What comes through here? Oh, that's what. Oh, I couldn't make it. I right, gotta do it again. Oh, come on. I thought I hit it. I right, run. Stop. Okay, run. St st I couldn't stop. Um. Okay, run. Stop. Run. Stop. Okay, run. Stop. Okay. Wait, my ma mice. Okay. That's one way to get rid of them. <laughs> Alright, so let's go this way. Oh, yeah, look, the hacker's here. I got the feeling there's a secret back door in this room, but where could it be? Hmm. Well, there's a chest here. Chain mail. <laughs> Alright, let me see. Let me see if that's good for any of us. That chain mail. Ooh, that is better for Chris. But I want to see if Rossi can use it. Because Rossi always dies, I promise you. Like, every time. He always dies. So I want a letter for me. Because get it, chain mail. Send it to 10 others or it'll lose its defensive rating. My gosh. Oh, but her defense is actually kind of low, too. I didn't realize. But I think it'll be fine. And she has a lot of health is the thing to make up for the defense. So I think we should go with that. Become lost in the craftsmanship. I'm the hacker. I got Okay. So we got to find the secret room. I guess do we have to find it before him or something. Wait, maybe it's this. No, it's not that. I guess we just gotta lead him down this hallway. Maybe he'll. Oh, wait, he pointed here. Secret switch. Heard something open. Okay, so we opened it. So is that literally all he does is just point it out for us? So what? Open. Oh, wait, I'm dumb. It's literally right here. <laughs> this right here. I wanna see if the hacker comes back to notice it, though. Yeah, see? See, because he's a. His. Um. His head is a computer mouse. So. Oh, he found it. Oh, he didn't find it. Okay, let's go down here.